Greetings, mortals. I am the Fallen Shogun, and we are back in a game I have covered once already, but it went free to play, so let's go and cover it again. Why did it go free to play? Not many people cared about its existence. It didn't update much, didn't have much in the way of variety, and there wasn't much to do. Now, I'm going to look at it again for the first time in months. Like, I haven't booted this game up in quite a while. This is Pandemic Express. So for those who bought the game, you got 2,000 shop points, as you can see. That would be $20 worth of shop points. I think that's about the price of the game. I can't remember. I really can't. What that gets you is head. As you can see, it vaguely changes the face of your mask. I think I'm wearing this one. Yes, I am. Obviously, this is an event, which I don't really know about. Um, so different points. But if it's five, if it's uh, five dollars for like five hundred. That is a one dollar mask, just there. And now, and this is what you look like. This is your one dollar mask. As you can see, it's super changey. This one here, mask of doubt, is thirty-five and looks so much better. It changes how you look. You also buy like clothes. This stuff's pretty cool. So as you can see, again, the spirit of hope, about a dollar. Does not change much. I'm currently wearing the jacket of vanity, but so is everyone else, so I might wear the leader's skin? The sweater of safety looks interesting. Let's go for sweater of safety. And you can also change your bag on your back. I think I'm wearing Yeah, I'm wearing a leader's prosthesis. I am wearing a thing on my leg, which is the bag of doubt, maybe. Let's go for the bag of doubt. So I'm just changing up. But yeah, and you can also buy the actual songs you get on the radio you can find at the very beginning. So there's very limited variety for the new things. So right now if you've bought the game, you've not got much to spend your money on. Like you can buy all the outfits if you really want to, but you know, there really isn't much in the way of needing to do that. Okay, There we go. So that's my character. Let's go into play. So the game is about 20 players. They have to find weaponry. Um, and then escape either on a train or apparently a cable car now. And I've played one game before this. And I was with one of the top ten players in the entire game. I'm not going to say their name. But as far as I could tell, that one guy would one-shot every single zombie in existence. So, I don't know if they've changed the weaponry, if he's really that skilled, or if hacking is really common currently. So we're going to have a look. But apparently there's no, like, protection in the game. But yeah, so we're going to load in. How it works is there's 20 people in a little station. It randomly picks one person to be a zombie. And they get, like, 10, 15 seconds before the doors close to kill as many people as possible. Then everyone has to rush out into the world, find items, and rush back to the train where they stand on it to make it move. Obviously, the more people who die, the more zombies there are. There's, like, boats which have, like, a limited health. There are trucks which have a limited health. But that's basically the gist of the game. There are about four maps. When I was playing it there before, there was one map. And that one map had four train stations, so you, could, you know, you could start randomly across the whole map, but you always saw the same map. But I think there's more maps. I think. I'm saying that, because, like, again, this is a first impression. I know how the game works. It needs to shock me in how amazingly new it is. As far as I can tell, well, loading's always a bit slow at the beginning. Eventually, I'm going to have to start cutting if this is just carries on going. Oh. 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 Okay, so 27 seconds. So you can mute people. Let's see. The world is loading around. So you'll find the good players all start jumping up top. You can tell who's a good player in the game or where they are. Looks like I was the last one in, it was waiting for me. So there's 20 players in the game. None of them are the top 10. You can tell by them having a little um, thing above their head. So one person will be randomly picked to be a zombie. 
And you don't want to be next to them because they might start trying to kill you. Follow me. So someone's now being picked. And you can tell which one it is because I have a glowy head. Like that guy over there is just running around. So we need the doors to open to escape. You can see him over there by the door stabbing people. He's not killed anyone yet. Come on. I'm pretty sure that's copyrighted, that music. Oh, the zombie just exploded. Zick Doom just killed someone. There's two of them. Door's still not opened. That's four dead. Okay. We need to run. So that glowy guy there is a zombie. There's a zombie looking at me. That behind me is a good zombie. Okay, there's a zombie right behind me. A zombie right behind me. A zombie just hit me. A zombie just hit me. There's a zombie right behind me. That was a health thing underneath me, but I need to run. So yeah, so the whole goal is to get better weapons. Now, the only way to get really good weapons in this game, really, is to get to the ammo drops. You can also slide. Like I say, nothing seems to have changed so far. I've like I've played this map a lot. Okay, you can also use bullet guns to like um, shoot yourself up things. Yeah, like, you like sort of rocket jump. Now I'm going to be going for that ammo crate. I'm probably not going to survive because I wasn't that good at, at the game in the first place. Hey, Fallen. Let's go to the I drop. But yeah, I'm not too good at the game, so I'm probably going to die, and a lot of people have already died in this game. It's not that far. But yeah, I haven't played for a while. Over here. I've only got a rifle, though, so I'm in a bit of trouble. Okay, I'm just going to go this way, sort it. Oh, oh, zombie, zombie, zombie! Wait, no, he's just punching me, never mind. He's just trying to kill me. I'm hurt. Help. Oh, I'm not good with his gun. Got him. Uh oh. Oh. Yeah, killed by Zodu. So, yeah, the best, the only way you can actually win this game is to get this weapon re uh, And, yeah. Because most of the basic weapons are absolute rubbish. Like that rifle, like single shot rifle. You can get, like, um, a shotgun. You can get, like, a single shot rifle. You can get, like, a pistol, submachine gun. The very rare assault rifle also exists. But, obviously, this chest has higher level gear. There's a tiering system of the weapon re um, there's also like an RPG. Can I just... Gosh, someone's still here. Didn't even notice. So you can be three different creatures. You can be a catcher, a bomber, or a mint. Obviously a bomber explodes. There we go. And you can't spawn where you can be seen. So you have to like sort of spawn places. Let's, have a look. Let's go here. So I look like an enemy... I look like a friendly player. So obviously I mean, I'm a sneaky guy. Help! Help! Oh, gotta love mimics. Gotta love mimics. See, they thought I was a friend. Mimics are cool, so you look exactly like another player, which is a sneaky one. Also, if I go that way after them, they will know it's me. Also, there's a few interesting issues like this. Okay, they both died there. Looks like they're thinking about resur to resurrect or not. Can I explode as a mimic? Obviously, I can't actually attack or anything with my gun. All I can do is hit. So, I'm carrying a shotgun. I can't use it, but I'm carrying it. 
If you actually look on the map at the bottom left, you can see the circle growing as, well, as they get on the train. Looks like there's six humans left and no one made it to the train. So when the players aren't mysteriously killing everyone dead easy, usually oh, shit. people die a lot quicker. But yeah, I'm the wrong zombie for this. He's escaping. Okay, I set my bomb off! Got one bomb left! Oh no. That's useful. Okay, I'm gonna hold down R and respawn. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> respawn in the wrong place. Okay, press R, take me to the spawn point. So, yeah, you get on the train or the cable car, whatever the case may be, and you have to ride it. Let's see. Let's, okay, I can spawn up here. Oh, I can't anymore. I've spawned a bit further. Okay, spawn up here. Obviously, they must know what I am. <laughs> I'm just dicking about with him. Because obviously I am a zombie, so they don't know that. Just like his friends. So yeah, the mimics are pretty interesting. I don't quite know how they work. I'm going to have to have a look at the thing again. Because the mimics didn't exist. In the game, oh, all you had was catchers and bombers. Looks like mimics are new, but as far as I can tell, not too sure they do. Yeah, let's go back to bombers. So bombers explode pretty violently. And there's also like your super zombies, which I think are the first zombie. The first zombie is super powerful. As you can see, we didn't do that well. I wasn't expecting to do that well. And that's how it generally goes. Most people die at the very beginning. Like, you don't generally have a full 10-man team survive. My god, only level. In fact, they've changed the levels again. I think I also got an achievement of playing the game for the first time. Apparently it protected the airdrop. Didn't see anyone using any super weapon there. But yeah, certain weapons are useless. Like, the rifle's terrible. The rifle's absolutely terrible. You wanted a assault rifle or something better. So half the guns in the game are useless. Is that a single shot rifle? Because it takes such a long time to reload. And the aiming is basically down the barrel. You literally have to have really, really good reflexes. So I should probably not be wearing certain gear. People will probably look at me and think, oh, yeah, we can kill him easy. So it's like the white circle to survive. So there's health you can find on the map. There's jaws you can get to get extra health. And there's weaponry in most of the buildings. And then obviously there's the ammo crate. But since it's got free to play, yeah. Um, obviously the skill level now is all over the place. Beforehand it was quite up there. Because there's only a small group of people actually playing the game. Let's have a look. Oh, we got 6 of 20. I've got to wait. Okay, but here's the board. Yeah, 4,000 and 7,000. I'm not doing too well. A bit suspicious about a couple of these people. Not all of them. I don't generally know what the skill level is, but some of them are going to hit like 15 people in one go. To get to there, it's just a slide run. I'm not that level of skilled. Yeah. So you have to sort of slide jump. It's the only way to really get away from the hoard at the bottom. Oh, never mind. They're all up there. You can also hit each other. So you just going to stay up there thing and punch people? No. Dang, 
Come on, go slide up here, okay. No, I'm not good enough to do the parkour in this game. My tribes is letting me down. Dagnabbit, yeah. Do you go sort of hit? Yeah, so it's like that, but actually hitting it. So you've got to hit these leaves. So one of the big draws of the game was meant to be the parkour. You can sort of slide down. Dagnabbit. You can slide down hills and things. Hopefully they actually own the rights to that music. Dagnabbit. So I can do it occasionally. But that's the only way we're going to get up to there, which everyone is now up there. So there isn't too many places to hide in the map, as you can see. Hello. The station A, B, C and D. Hello. So what happens is you basically see the same place over and over again. Look, there's a lot more places to hide. Before, it was just like nothing. Now you can sort of hide in the water, you can hide in the grass. It's slightly harder for the zombie to kill everyone at the very beginning. Before you had like entire massacres of people. They actually the same names on both sides. I wonder if some people like playing as zombies. Could be a thing. Could very well be a thing. But yeah, when you start, there's usually one or two guns hidden in the map. Inside the place. And a radio. <laughs> oh, there's one of the top players. Where are they on the list? Who are they? Alex. They're definitely higher than me, but not on the top 14. Wait, no, no there they are. They're one of the top three zombies. Oh, that's not good. So he's, a, he's one of the top 14 zombie players just there. I'm going to go hide in the grass. Zombies! Zombies! Help! Zombies! Someone's a zombie. Maybe the AFK? Maybe it's a glitch. The game is still not very well made. He might Alex AHK might kill himself to become a zombie. Zombies. Yep. Zombies. Okay. So what happens is in this game, people who become the zombie at the beginning just kill themselves or leave. It's cool. It's cool. Like I say, some of the guns you're going to need is an assault rifle or a shotgun. Oh. I'm going to get up this tower. So, yeah. So players just leave, only 20 people, so obviously when you start losing players it gets really difficult. I've already taken a hit I think. But yeah, not much has really changed, it's still the same game, there's still not much in it. Oh, I have two pistols now. Cool, um, so it gave me more pistols. I have no ammo! No. Uh -oh. I have a good with no ammo. Is an ammo glitch or something? Is that a zombie over there driving that boat? Okay, I need a gun with actual ammo in it. What's this? Okay, there we go. 
So I've got a pistol. It's useless, but I'll take it. It's got six shots better than the two than the three shot I was originally using. Guess I'm gonna keep the crappy gun I can't get rid of. Oh, it was glitched. I had a glitched gun, which is giving me extra ammo for some unknown reason. And there's only pistols in here. There's only pistols. Yep. So I've only got a pistol. Uh, I'm probably going to die again. I was very lucky I killed that other guy last time. Very lucky that guy came out with the assault rifle, if I'm honest. Hmm. That's where the train is. It's not open yet. Uh oh. Super zombie. Okay, let's go after him. Run, 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 run! I don't want to be next to the super zombie. Well, he's dead. <laughs> he's very dead. But yeah, the game's not changed. There's still glitches. They've still not really fully fixed it. I think there are a fair bit of hackers in the game, but I can't confirm it. Maybe that guy was good enough to kill 40 or 50 people in a couple of minutes. Just pistols in this. Is that what... Give me a shotgun at the very least. Okay, that's health. Take the extra health. Someone's going after the ammo. That'll be useful because I've only got a pistol. Go for those. They bounce you. If I hit them properly, they would have. Can we escape yet? I don't have the guns for this. Do not have the guns for this. Where does cabbage port? Okay, it's open. He's got a he's got a gun at least, so I know he's a real human. Okay, so yeah, the more people you have on here, the faster it moves. Obviously, a zombie each time will also cancel it out, and zombies can spawn above you. Before they could only spawn at the spawn tower, so that big thing we were inside, but now they can literally spawn anywhere. So zombies have a greater chance of mass murdering you. Got him. Okay, luckily, bombies die pretty quickly. Whoa! Bombie! That hurt. That hurt. That was too health. Okay, you can get heal stations. Damn those bombies! Also, we've got these the super elites. They take a lot of hits. Uh oh, it's right behind me! It's right behind me! Killed a rat! He was next to me! Oh no, we've lost rat! Uh oh. There's a health station up top. I need a health station. I also need some ammo. A new gun would be nice too. Being left behind is going to be a problem. Oh my god, I can hear some serious gunfire going off. Just pistols! We have to run after them. Oh no! <laughs> he was hiding! Time to leave!
Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, they're shooting at me. They must think I'm a zombie. Oh, this is not a good accurate gun. <laughs> the spring green. Damage light. No, I'm in the water. The gun don't work in the water. Uh oh. No, I need that gun. God, there's bombs everywhere. No, 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 no. Oh no! Something's looking at me. My vision's gone weird. Something's looking at me. So yeah. Oh, okay. If they're shooting a gun, they're safe. If they're not shooting a gun, they're not safe. Can I not heal myself? It's empty. I'm going to ammo. Thank God someone has this gun died. Oh, where was that? No! I'm so low on health. I'm going to bomb. No! So close. Maybe don't believe I'm still alive. <laughs> See, that's how it usually goes. Oh, there's a truck here. Oops. Uh oh. Yeah, he's pretending as well. Oh! Yato, you arse! <laughs> oh. So yeah, the game's not changed too much. I still don't think there's a big draw to it, if I'm honest. I think there might be a bigger draw now it's free to play, because you can like, play, you know, play with your friends. It's a big massive screw you to those who bought it, because it's not really changed too much. There he is. But there you are. What do I do? Do I put down bombs or something? Is that what I do? I do. I put. Oh, I put down fake things which are fake bombs. My entire thing is literally to put down fake bombs. Oh, okay. I now know what the mimic does. I literally follow behind, put fake bombs, fake health. Okay, so yeah, it's all right. It's good when there's no hackers on. Like, this is how a game usually goes. Massive amounts of death. And it's quite fun for the last stand. Like, I was fighting with a pistol to the very end. But yeah, it's alright. I definitely recommend picking it up now. It's free. Whether the longevity is for you is not for me to say. I got bored after two hours before. Two hours was my limit and we never went back to it. We went straight back to Dead by Daylight. For like another three months. This game does not have much longevity. It literally is the same thing over and over and over again with very, very little variety. Very little variety. So whether you get the fun out of it is 
good for you, but um, for me, it's just too much. This is, this is a, you've seen the game twice now. This is exactly what the game is. Either way, I've been the Fallen Show. This is the free to play Pandemic Express. Hopefully, you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Ciao for now. Be awesome. Be epic, and I will be seeing you. Eleven zombies. That's pretty good. What's my score for that? Not sure what levels do, but I'll take them. Yay! Great!